think a lot of people think that CMT is not being able to run and it's not being able to jump and maybe it's not being able to walk up really tall staircases, which for me it is all of those things, but it's also a million little things. I have started working with a personal trainer recently to try to get stronger. He was telling me that I needed to work on improving my hydration. So he told me, okay, I need you to have four tall glasses of water every day and I need you to log that. And I logged it for a couple weeks and he came back and he said, you're not meeting your goal. Why are you not drinking the water? I, I probably traumatized him a little bit because I started crying and I started describing to him what it actually means for me to go get a glass of water. First, I have to get up from the couch. And that's not the hardest step, but it is harder. And then I have to walk without my braces because I don't wear my braces in the house. I have to walk to the kitchen. And that is always a risk of falling. So I'm hugging the walls, I'm grabbing onto, you know, door handles and door frames, trying not to fall on my way to the kitchen. And then I have to get a glass. And I have to try to not knock over and break a glass this time while I pull them out. And I have to go and take that glass and I have to fill it up. And then with my weak little hands, I have to carry that glass and now I can't hold on to the walls. And I can't grab the door handles and I have to walk back to the couch without falling and without dropping the glass of water. That's what it means for me to have CMT.